Hey, what's up guys? So today was a much better day than uh, yesterday, although um, I only made back um, part of what I lost, but um, you know, it is what it is. Um, so anyway, um, so at the open, uh, stop look week, it did pop up, um, but on level two, it wasn't really doing anything. It took on a short side, um, the, but I did get out too early. It continues to collapse. Now, the whole market, I didn't anticipate the market to just collapse on every stock. Uh, and they pop back up. And this is um, when I took it on the short side, um, level here on uh, 15 minute. It abutted this level. So I felt confident taking it on the short side. Um, but again, I got out too early when it struggled at this uh, moving average. Uh, reason for that is yesterday um, when I had opportunities to get out I didn't <laughs> so today I did but unfortunately um, you know it did drop to my uh, the level I, I was hoping for which is 47 um, it did drop to that but I got out way too early so um, I got nervous from yesterday so <sighs> it is what it is so that was Neo um, traded uh, Billy uh, a few times. So Billy dropped all the way down, um, like, like every other stock. I was holding this level, which is corresponding to a daily um, moving average. So it dropped to a daily moving average. I went in long, um, popped up, um, and then I got out. Um, but I accidentally got out too much, so then I covered. Uh, fortunately, I did that um, ahead of the, uh, the run up. So um, yeah, so, so that was uh, a hot key mistake. But always get out when you have a hot key mistake. Um, QS, same thing, it dropped, tanked all the way down. Um, here it hit a 60 uh, minute moving average uh, and, and that's when I went in um, and then I, I got out. It dropped again. Uh, I, I didn't know if this was gonna continue to fall down so I didn't go back in but it made a huge run up um, and then at this point because it formed a double top it got pretty close um, on the flip side to the uh, moving average on the top here um, I don't know why it's not as apparent 15 minutes oh that's why 15 minutes so it's getting close to this um, and then on level 2 it shows it was getting pretty weak um, and so that's why I took it on the short side uh, and then on the drop, it got caught in this moving average. I got out, uh, it did come back up and then make a further retreat, but who knows this, you know, the market was kind of recovering a bit. Um, everything was moving up a bit. So I didn't know this was gonna continue to run up. So, um, so yeah, I, I just got it all out. Um, Piton, lost a lot of money on Piton. I made back up a small amount today. Uh, I missed this part, the rebound, uh, did go all the way up. I took it on the short side when it uh, got close to moving average. Uh, reason for this is um, at the 60 minute mark, um, oh, 15, 15 minute mark, it did get close to this moving average, which is where I originally set my, uh, my short order. Um, but fortunately for me, I took it on the short side, it dropped, I got out, and then it popped. I uh, never really got back down to, to where it was. Um, so uh, the stock became strong uh, pretty much the rest of the way until until now. Um, but, but yeah, playing it safe, um, took it on the short side and just got out. Uh, bad taste in my mouth from yesterday. So um, this was Piton. Um, we talked about Billy already. EXAS uh, went up um, again on 15 minute, got close to a moving average. Um, actually, I was gonna I set my level way up here. It didn't look like I was gonna make it on level two, so I just went in, took it short side, uh, and then on the drop, I got out um, very close to where I wanted to, uh, which is 138. It did eventually make it down to 137 before bouncing, but, um, but yeah, you never know. PDD, same thing, uh, huge collapse. Uh, got close to the daily level, I took it for the bounce um, on the pop, I got out. Um, it did make a huge run, all the way up to 185 actually. Uh, but I, I got out um, at the level that I got out at because um, I, I'm just a bit nervous about, uh, about the market since yesterday's uh, debacle. So. Uh, and then we talked about QS already. So yeah, that's it. I made back uh, some of the money that I lost yesterday. But I had a pretty big loss. But 
you know, it's not really about making the money back right away on the next day. It's about getting your confidence back. I think um, Humboldt Trader on YouTube said it best, you know, it's, it's really about confidence, getting it back. Uh, the money will always come because you look at it on the, on the long side, the long game, right? Uh, on the tough loss, you just have to be mentally tough and just not try to make everything back right away and just go for uh, small wins. Uh, I was fortunate I got a pretty big win today, uh, but not nearly enough as my losses. I still got to um, have to work on that. Um, but otherwise, um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm happy about my performance today. And uh, yeah, nothing too crazy. So um, I hope you guys are doing well, um, doing better than me, hopefully. Uh, stay green, stay healthy, and uh, I'll see you next time. Peace out. And don't forget, like and subscribe.